Hello guys, welcome to HexDNF again, and the topic for this video is how to retrieve livestock data from the internet. In this case we're going to work with investing.com and we're going to download our data and import it to Microsoft Excel. Okay, here we are set up in Google Chrome browser. You could use the browser you like. Uh, we are going to go to investing.com just type it in the search bar then you could go to the search bar to the livestock search bar um, you have any stock uh, uh, to choose uh, I will, I'm going to choose NVIDIA Corporation NVDA for its ticker and then we're going to go to historical data And here we have the time frame. You could choose daily, weekly, and monthly. And here's the time span. Let's choose uh, any time span. Could be, uh, for example, you could go to September 2022, uh, June 9, September 2022, to September 2023, August. 10. Then you click on the apply button and then you download. You could drag this here to the desktop. I used to do it uh, for easier terms. <laughs> okay guys, now here in the Excel workbook, we're going to import the data we just downloaded already from investing.com. Okay. If you have this Excel version, this is Excel 2019, the English with the English language. Uh, you're going to data model, then select data power query function, and the type of data we're going to import in is a CSV file, which means which means a comma separated value file. <coughs> choose the document we just we already renamed in the desktop NVIDIA historical data we get the data we choose next and load okay usually Excel displays the data with a pretty uh, default format so if you would like to format yourself because you have uh, your own style or whatever you select here you go to data oh, or you could select here you go to filter you delete the filter then you select here then you go to the eraser function <laughs> clear formats and then you're set up to format yourself by your own now let's fix this up we select here this range we select a royal font or the font you like we select the date range the date column we change the format to short date it's very recommended we set it bold here Now to end this part, we save this workbook as investing.com dataset NVIDIA. And we close the window. To sum up, we learned how to get into the website, select the data, download it and import it to Microsoft Excel using the Power Query function. So that's all guys, see you for the next video, stay tuned in HexDNF, bye bye.